stretch, you're gonna need a TheraBand. If you don't have a TheraBand, you can use like a yoga strap, a pair of tights, like a pair of nylon tights if you have one, um, a belt, like if you have a leather belt, anything um, that you could just like wrap your foot around. So yeah, so let's get started. Even if you have like the strap for um, your yoga mat, that could work too. Okay, I'm just gonna use my TheraBand because it's with me today. If you don't have a TheraBand, I totally would say invest in one of these. They're like maybe 10 bucks off of Amazon. They're amazing to stretch with. Love them, 10 out of 10. And no, this is not an ad for TheraBands. Not that popular yet. <laughs> okay. So let's just start with putting our foot around the band, yeah? And if you don't have a band, just grab your leg, right? So let's just roll back to our mat, yeah? And let's just do a nice up and down movement. And if you don't have a TheraBand, just lift your leg up and down, yeah? Good job. And I have my TheraBand in one hand. It kind of rhymed, TheraBand in one hand. Keep going, I just need to set my, my timer here. Good job. Keep that up. Okay, so now you're gonna take your strap. Um, and if you don't have a strap, you could just leave your hands down on the ground like that. You're gonna take your strap and you're gonna bring your knees in and out, up, in, out, good job, up, in, out. We're just doing a nice little bicycle movement here, where they just warm up those hip flexors. And let's reverse, so down, up, and down, up, good job, down, up, down, up, all right. Let's switch sides. All right, left leg going up. Okay, got that between my leg, my foot. If you don't have a TheraBand, like I said before, just put your hands down on the ground. I'll do the same thing. Okay, so just lower and lift. Lower, lift, good job. Lower, and lift, lower, and lift. Let's just do two more. One more. Excellent, okay. Grab that strap in both hands. And we're gonna just do the bicycle, so in. Push out and up, in, push out, a good job, in, push out and up, good job, out, up, keep going. Last one. Reverse, bring it down. Knee in and up. Let's go down. Knee in and up. Good job. Down, in, up, down, in, up. All right, let's just take that strap, roll it to the side. Not going to need it for a bit. And let's just bring our knees into our chest. Let's just rock from side to side. Massage that lower back. Excellent. So we're gonna just bring our knees to the right side of us. Just drop them down, a gentle drop. And just put your head all the way to the left. Stay nice, beautiful. Chorus of 
spin bikes. We're gonna just switch and bring our legs to the other side. Nice little opener. Really bring those shoulders down. Relax it out. This is one of the best stretches to do in the morning, at night, before you go to bed. Yeah. Okay, let's just bring that up. We're gonna just roll up. You could do a roll up or you could do like a little rolling like ball up. That's always fun, right? All right. Let's do our nice little hamstring stretch. Now this is, once again, we're gonna try and use our strap or whatever we got going on over there. But if you don't have one, that's totally okay. All right. So, my AirPod keeps falling out. <laughs> All right. So, the first thing we're not going to need it. So, put that mat, uh, whatever it is, put it to the side. So, just point your feet and let's just straighten our backs. Lift shoulders up. Spray our arms all the way up and bring them all the way down to our toes. Yes. And roll it back up. All the way up and to our toes. And roll back up. Good job. Up and all the way down. Tuck those toes and roll those hands. Get the nice warmth of your hands on your legs. Let's go one more time. Really drag those hands against your body. Get that warmth from your hands into your thighs, into your calves and shins. So the next time we're gonna go all the way down. I'm gonna flex my feet this time. And I'm just gonna bring my hand and clasp it around either my ankle, my thigh, foot, my calf, but not my knee, never the knee. And now, grab your trusty TheraBand strap, whatever you're using. I'm just gonna call it TheraBand for this video's sake. Wrap that around. And we're just gonna roll up and bring that leg up with us, yes? And now if you don't have TheraBand, just simply grab your leg and hold it. TheraBand's gonna give you a nice tug. Put your band in one hand. You put your hand right behind you. And we're gonna just stretch across the body. Good job. Put it in the other hand. And just open that leg out to the side. If you want a little bit more of a stretch, you could bring your hand across. Bring it up right in front of you. I'm gonna just give that a nice bend in. I like to turn in my leg when I do this. Good job. Bring it back up. Bring it back up. And bring that down. Take that off your leg. Shake that leg out. Next side. Ready? Okay, let's do. Arms up. Point those feet. Flex them. Bring it down to your left foot. And just grab it right there. Give yourself a nice little pull. All right. I'm gonna grab my trusty paraband. I'm gonna wrap it around my left foot. And let's just levitate that leg up. Yes.
Bring that leg open to the side. And across. And just open it up again. You bring it into your chest. Up again and bring it back down. Shake those legs out. We're gonna just sit facing forward. We're gonna sit with our, um, we're gonna have our feet together, just glued together, and bring those heels as close to the inner body as you can. And we're just going to bring our hands on the top of our knees, and we're gonna pull our chest forward. And up. Good job, forward. Step. And the best thing to do when you're stretching is to breathe. Now I mentioned this in previous classes, but really just breathe through these exercises, these stretches. If you hold your breath, it's not doing anyone good. Really breathe it out. Okay. So next thing we're going to do is we're going to open our right leg up. We're going to bring this left leg into it, like a nice little bent position. And we're going to just turn our hips towards our right foot. And we're going to stretch all the way down. Good job. Try and get that nose to the knee. And then we're gonna rotate and stretch those obliques. We're gonna switch sides. It's facing our leg. We're gonna just switch down. The side up and over. It's really important to have that chest facing forward. And come back up. Okay. So the last thing we're going to do is we're gonna just do a nice child's pose. We're gonna just hold this one more. Oh, those are my knees on the ground. I don't have bad knees, just everything cracks. I'm only 23, look at that. So we're gonna just bring those arms straight out ahead. Head down to the mat and just hold here. This is a great place to find your breath. Just breathe. Walk those hands all the way to the right.
and walk those hands all the way to the left. Bring it back to center. We're going to stay here for a few more seconds. Head down onto the mat. And bring our hands up, and we're going to slowly, one vertebrae at a time, roll up through our backs. We're going to do this in 10 counts. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Good job. All right, everyone clap it out. Thank you so much for coming today. Just stop recording.